Yo, how's it going guys? My name's Omicron and welcome back to another Bed Wars video. So today in this video, we're going to be doing some more epic Bed Wars gameplay because I know you guys have absolutely been loving this. So if we can please hit 50,000 likes and maybe an extra 100,000 subscribers to my YouTube channel, that would be absolutely amazing. Anyway guys, let's just get right on to the gameplay and I hope you enjoy the video. Anyway, sorry I had to subject you guys to that. I genuinely had no idea what I wanted to do in my video for the video intro. So I kind of just did the first thing that came off the top of my head and that was it apparently. So on my last Last Bed Wars video, the knockback stick only challenge. If you haven't seen it, I highly recommend you go check it out. Shameless promotion because I'm a YouTuber, damn it. If you haven't seen it, I just used the knockback stick only instead of any other weapon. And a lot of people were like, yeah, that's impressive, but here's the thing knockback stick is still a pretty decent weapon. I mean, come on, knockback one? So, you know. Uh, we're gonna do fist only challenge. If that wasn't already clear by either the title or what I'm doing now. Oh my god, just freaking. Is it that hard to just freaking fly off the map? Maybe I'm just not try hard enough. That is at least the plan. I don't really have any other ideas. I was originally- Oh, shoot. Uh, close enough. I was originally gonna limit myself and be like, all right, we're gonna do no other items other than wool and my fist. But I- I'm gonna be honest, I, I'm- I like playing Bed Wars and I like doing these challenges, but I'm not stupid, okay? I'm not gonna, like, limit myself. You know how long that would take to get a recording like that? But I think I'm gonna buy some armor, some solo upgrades, and stuff like that, because I'm gonna be honest, guys, I wanna actually win this game pretty fast. I have other things to do, such as college apps. Ugh! So I'm just gonna use these. I'm not gonna use them as a weapon, or I'll, I'll try not to. Again, if I pick up a block that does, like, sharpness 10 damage or something like that, then that's out of my control. But I'm just gonna keep the first slot open so I'm always using a fist. Like, if I hit someone with a block, c come on. You're not gonna call me out on that, are you? That is at least the plan. I, my experience with these kinds of strategies is just that, oh my god, uh, well, stuff like that happens. Just kind of brain dead mistakes. Oh my god, I just bought a stone sword by accident. Well, it looks like that's 10 iron down the drain. I'd like to say that I'm book smart in Bed Wars, just the fact that I don't really. Oh, nice job, dude. Stuff like that happens to me, and then occasional dumb mistakes that that I shouldn't be making. I'm kind of just decent at PvP, at least in my opinion. Like, I don't want to be all egotistical. Like, I'm the best PvPer in the world, guys. But I would think of myself as, like, fairly decent at PvP. As far as Bed Wars skill goes, in terms of, like, bridging, I am... <laughs> that's, a, that's a good meme. All right, you guys ready for this? Fist only challenge. Sharpened swords. Let's go! I'm gonna have the sharpest freaking hands in the west of the Mississippi. Hey there, red dude. Hope you don't mind me just kind of chilling. Oh, this is a nice bed. I really like this, actually. This is... You spent a lot of time on this, and I'm glad. So, uh... What's the best way to do this? Okay, well... Uh... Oh, uh... Sweat mode engaged with my sharpened fists. Okay, there we go. The, the sad part about this is that you break this wool block, and it's kind of just there, so, like, this clay and stuff's kind of irrelevant, but, uh... Overall, I really like the fact that you spent all this effort into your bed. I'm just gonna have to tell you to go over there for a second, though. Every day, millions of Bed Wars players are beaten to death with the power of the human hands. You too can stop this by donating to the Omicron GoFundMe. Together, we can stop fisting in Bed Wars. And that was Aqua over here. I'm probably losing my bed. That That's fine, honestly. I could care less. Oh, he's over there. Hey, dude, you want to do a bed exchange? I'm so down to do a bed exchange. Bed exchanges make the game, like, so much more fun. It's like when you're playing Overwatch and you kind of just... Oh, okay, mining fatigue. That's fine. Did he just... You're not going to save your bed that way, dude. I'm just going to be honest. I, I honestly don't think that's a good idea. Okay. Hmm. 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 Hey, first try. Not bad. Okay. I was gonna say, it's kind of like when you're playing Overwatch and you do an ult exchange with someone else on the opposing team. Like, your ult basically cancels out their ult, so it's like, no ults actually happen, but... You know, it's it's kind of just neutral in the end. I don't know why I'm talking. I should, <laughs> this is Bed Wars, not Overwatch. Jesus. On the topic of other games, if you're at all interested, I am planning on doing other games and maybe just meme videos and stuff on my second YouTube channel and also uh, streaming on my Twitch channel a little bit more. So, you know, highly recommend following me and subscribing to me on both those platforms. The great thing about having a second channel is that you can literally upload anything you want to that channel and every time someone says, whoa, dude, you're... Your uploads are just kind of all over the place. You can be like, nah, it's okay, man. It's my second channel. I can do whatever I want. I never realized that power until I uploaded all the copyrighted stuff, which was amazing because it turns out the great thing about having a second channel is that you can say that you uploaded so-and-so meme video, but 
Oh my god. Okay, so I'm losing this fight. That's fine. But I don't have to worry about the copyright, you know, restrictions on my YouTube channel because it's not my main YouTube channel. Big win. Come on. Come on. Okay, my aim is so trash. Holy crap. I need to get lucky here. That That's pretty damn lucky. Later. Oh, that was really close. That could have been terribly bad. This challenge is great because it gives me an entirely new perspective on uh, Bed Wars in general and just Bed Wars strategies. I have one block. Check out this block placement. Amazing. Oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> Places down the one block. Nope. Not happening. I don't really have much of a chance here because he's got like kind of the advantage. Well, I can just do this. Hold on. Ready for this epic Minecraft strat? I call it getting killed. Patent pending, don't worry. Yeah, I feel this strategy kind of makes me think of Bed Wars in almost entirely differently. Like, normally in Bed Wars, it's like, you're mostly worried about, you know, bridging fast, getting there, attacking beds while also keeping yours alive. In this challenge, all I'm trying to do is just mess with people. I'm just trying to knock them off the damn map. Okay, I just want to drop down on this guy like I'm a freaking spider insect. Okay, sweat. I'm not a sweat, dude. I'm freaking doing the no f no sword fist only. What is it called? I don't know. <laughs> I'm doing that challenge later, and now it's just me against Jake plays YT. We should do like a little YouTuber duel or something, and be like, whoever loses this game has to shout out the other person's YouTube channel on their YouTube account. So, uh, good luck. Up. Oh, I don't think you guys are ready for this. Ready? 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 Sharpen swords. Let's go, sharpen fists. I think I'm gonna make that a tradition that for every Bed Wars challenge that I do, I have to buy sharpen swords, even if the challenge doesn't. Necessarily necessarily uh allow swords to be used where is this dude oh he's over what is he doing isn't this his bed no oh, this, this is definitely his bed <laughs> maybe he's going over to my base i don't know i just got that bed is he at my bed what is oh i can just like jump off whatever commit suicide for the greater good just want to be clear if youtube is trying to automatically you know transcribe my videos what are you doing buddy <laughs> i just want to let you know that that was not a promotion for suicide okay mental health is a serious issue you should go see someone if you need that kind of help but in bed wars it's an entirely different story all right jake come out a true oh he's freaking invisible dude okay well i don't want to actually deal with this later fool what do you plan to do? I can see his outline. <laughs> nice strat! Let's go! That was amazing, Jake! Do that again! I swear I have better luck with Bed Wars games that I do a stupid challenge on than actual Bed Wars. Like, regular Bed Wars, like, get, like, hacked on or something like that. Next thing you know, this guy's in an invis potion while I'm doing the fists-only challenge. Anyway, thanks for watching this video where I take my 38-star Bed Wars account, holy crap, and start fisting people to death in Bed Wars. No inappropriate content intended. My game name is Omicron. Oh my god, I tried to make a good outro and I completely failed. My name is Omicron, and, uh, yeah, subscribe, like if you enjoyed comment something interesting because you guys always like to my fps was almost at 420 oh oh the 420 uh okay anyway uh, i'll see you guys in the next video peace out <laughs>